everybody, welcome to my new channel, Bantra Builds. My name is Troy Bannon, and I'm a 19 year old builder apprentice here in Auckland, New Zealand. This whole channel, I've been trying to start for a long time, but I haven't found that little bit of extra time to finally get into it, but I've forced myself to stay up late tonight to get a start and maybe get something out, we'll soon find out. But this whole channel is something that I want to get out there to separate myself from my parents' business, Banner Construction to find my own respect and name in the trade as my own tradesman and also inspire and showcase what it's like for younger generations, what it could be like, sorry, um, to be in the trades and have it as your career as I really do enjoy what I do and wouldn't change it for anything. So I think it's really important that I can spread that message and potentially inspire people to get into it as we need more passionate people in the trades in New Zealand. And just to bring one kid that doesn't know what he wants to do to being a builder or being a plumber, whatever it may be, doesn't have to be building would be wicked. So I want to cover things from tool reviews to my latest projects and to how to's anything that you guys think that would be awesome to see me do. Let me know. Um, I'll see what I think. I'm still new to this whole camera thing. I hate talking to cameras, but we'll get used to it eventually. And, um, yeah, like I say, we're, uh, We'll get better as we go. So if it's something you think you might be interested in when it comes to um, tool comparisons between brands, a lot of Makita stuff will be reviewed because I have a lot of Makita and I'm a big fan of Makita. But also fencing, decks, concreting, you name it, I can do it. So subscribe if you want to see more. I know this is my first video and it's a big ask, but I'll be trying to upload once a week possibly, um, which would be awesome if I can keep up to that. So fingers crossed I can get enough content. Um, that I'm happy to share. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take you guys downstairs to my workshop, show you what my van looks like day to day um, as a builder and what I carry with me. Yeah, so now we're down here in my Makita Garrett. This is where I do all my little home projects and cleaning of my gear and yeah I'll show you the van so this is the van setup I built the day after I got the van last year in July and it works pretty damn well for me so I've got a little trailer net that I let throw um, through over on the top to stop things flying around and secure them down which works really well so benefit of having this extra space up here is I can still throw over two, uh, two four by twelve hundred sheets of plywood and um, I find that really handy as I'm always picking that up. So these drawers I built specifically to fit these Makita boxes so I can keep the maximum, maximum space available for this drawer here for the bigger items. But it works perfectly for these as they all stack and you fit a fair amount in there. I've got a battery trimmer, grinders, two grinders in there. I've got my um, battery multi-tool, some of my batteries, and we've got... Yeah, jigsaws, sanders, metal cutting skillies, everything. So that's awesome. I also throw in random things there occasionally. Put a lot of things. Usually it's always the drop saw, keeping that locked away and out of sight is a massive thing. And keeping all the other little things, little kind of individual tools, skill saws, saber saws, pin gun, um, PLS lasers and everything all stacked away and they're really nice. So that works really well for me. Um, just the convenience of it all really and depending on the job I stack in different things so uh, over there I've got a shelving unit that I've um, got tools stacked in there I've got some corded gear that I don't carry every day as um, the battery gear is obviously replacing a lot of that um, for the convenience but sometimes you do depending what it is so we have it there in case but yeah it's having a van set up like this is massive in terms of efficiency productivity and um, the quality of what you can achieve basically um, I will be doing a video on this van setup a full run around once it's been cleaned out and worked on in the next week or so but to show you through the side here so I've left this an open space so we still got access to leaving the seats back when you want and having that that comfort there still but also having that extra height here to stack a wheelbarrow um, for certain jobs or higher higher items but we've got a little dewalt table saw it's a beautiful thing that i use so that's there that's the main tool that isn't in the boot 
Um, and then I've also got a little container, fish, fish bin container, where I keep all three of my aprons. Yes, I have three aprons, different, different uses. One's a scaffold apron, I've got a everyday building apron and a finishing apron. So again, that's another video I'll be into um, in the coming weeks. So yeah, um, again, subscribe if you want to see more. I'm hoping to try to get this sorted for you guys ASAP and get into this and yeah, let me know what you want to see, what interests you and we'll be in touch.